five laps in the semi-final here. Toe Hill with loads of smoke coming out the back here. We are green light racing here and Ovenden just squeezes Godfrey and almost looked like he wanted to go through into turn number one, but it's going to be Flitney and Ovenden into the Joker here. And the front three, uh, as it sails, will indeed be Toe Hill. It will indeed be Godfrey. And then in just behind them is Hal Ridge up towards that devil's elbow and Hal Ridge getting completely sideways there, grabs the grass and that is spectacular looking but ultimately not the quickest way here godfrey already losing a little bit of time and actually looks like his right door is ajar it looks like the right door is trying to open up there which is definitely not ideal front three then coming down in towards paddock bend you can see the ovenden getting the car sideways at the top of the hill godfrey going through sideways in towards that chicane as well very much the same as how ridge how ridge then comes into the joker in that ford focus ovenden now, is he going to be ahead, though? That's the question. Ovenden went in in lap number one. We will see the merge just in the background. I'll tell you what, I think Ovenden's going to be super close here. He is actually ahead. So Hal Ridge then, who just had a load of dust kicked up by Ovenden into uh, his windscreen, is ultimately now down into P4. So here we go then. Toehill. Big opportunity to win this semi-final. Big opportunity to indeed close that gap in the championship order, or indeed potentially take the lead as we come then through paddock bend once again godfrey is on the limit of the car good to see him with a nice clear run to be completely honest like he's just had so much misfortune this weekend has been right in amongst it in terms of the timesheets but ultimately the performance has just been an issue in each and every race he's been involved in so far and most of it not his own fault so here we go, through the devil's elbow then, and Godfrey is on it. Absolutely on it here. Toe Hill though, well, it's towing him up the hill as it stands. Through the apex we will come. And we will only have two laps remaining once this lap is finished. Through Paddock Bend once again. Both getting the car nice and sideways. Godfrey more so than Toe Hill. And as we head then towards turn one, and Godfrey does decide to come in here. And has he got enough cover here on Ovenden? I think he has. I think it's going to be relatively simple. Uh, we will see Ovenden now come into turn number one. There we go. Great merge then. Uh, great camera shots as well. As actually, it looks like Godfrey's got parts of his car missing at the back. He doesn't want any more misfortune here. He doesn't need any more misfortune here. But that does not look good. Yeah, the rear bumper is completely hanging off. Hopefully, that is not affecting his tyres. We don't want to see a puncture or anything like that. It looks like it's actually being splayed off. Oh, no, he does look like he's struggling to get the car rotated. Unfortunately here, Ovenden will see that. And he'll think, I'm going to pounce like a panther here. I'm going to take my opportunities. There's got to be something wrong with that car in front. And now as they head on to the final lap of this race, you can see then Toehill coming out of the Joker here. Yeah, just about ahead of Godfrey. It wasn't a great lap from him. So his entry lap to the Joker was not good. So Godfrey maybe had an opportunity. He made one mistake at the top of the hill. And you look back on it now, Godfrey could have won this race. What does that mean for the final layer on? Has Godfrey finally got that pace? Has he hit the level at the right time? Has he hit the form at the right time? Ultimately, he's not going to win this race, I don't think. I think Toe Hill's going to get it. But Godfrey, there's something there. He has found some form. Hopefully, the car damage is not terminal. He's going to be good. It's just, you know, aesthetic. It's fine. But as they cross the line, Toe Hill does take the victory. Godfrey will take second. Ovenden will be in third position. Hal Ridge then does take fourth spot. Dom Flitney in fifth position.